Hello, this is the always rockin' Guilty Gear X on Dreamcast, and uh, as soon as I figure out how to get out of here again, I don't remember. Oh no. Oh, okay. Uh, we're gonna play some of what is called Survival. It's different than the survival in the recent 3D Guilty Gear games. Now I'm playing through in order from top left. And so the last person I played was Jam. So now it's, oh no, it's Zato1. Uh, I don't think I'm very good with him, but... We're going to see what we can do. Let's hit the start button and see what color that gives us. So this survival mode, well, I, I don't have the latest Guilty Gear, uh, Guilty Gear Strive. It does have a survival mode. As far as I can tell from online video, oh my gosh, this is, this is quite the color. Oh, it's loud. Oh, it's so loud. I turned my headphones up because I thought it was a little quiet, and I was so wrong. Wow, this track is totally drowning out the sound effects, even. Uh, this survival mode gets hard pretty much right away. Whereas in... I, I did play some of the survival mode in Xard. Xard? I don't know how you say that one. And uh, it was it was it was easy. It just starts. You have to fight so many just sort of nothing battles at the beginning of that one survival mode, and and the one in Strive looks pretty much the same difficulty wise. Also, these uh, latter day Guilty Gear survival modes don't have the sort of level up mechanic that this one does, where you're constantly gaining levels, and the goal is to reach level 100. And at every, starting with level 20, at every 10 levels you hit a mini-boss or something like that. You do have mini-bosses. I, I did see someone had a video of some kind of mini-boss in Guilty Gear Strive. Survival mode. I don't know how long it would take to get there or anything. Um, I, I noticed that, so this is Guilty Gear X on Dreamcast. There's... Accent Core, Guilty Gear, something, 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 Accent Core, uh, on PS3. That has a survival mode, which is a lot like this one, except that they, they, they raise the max level from 100 to 1,000. I think it's 1,000. They added, uh, skills that you get, can get, and then can level up as you go along, and they made the difficulty uh, uh, slope much much less steep so it's kind of like the it's kind of like XRD and I guess strive in, in the difficulty aspect and uh, I, I, I have a video of myself playing that one I think it's my last accent core video and I'm not Obviously not very good anyway, but I I still had a, a play, a survival play with Kai that took an hour and a half. And I didn't even get to level 500 out of 1,000. So you could be looking at like a three hour plus playthrough if you're actually good enough at survival mode to get all the way through. And it's like, well, I can't really do that. That's crazy. I got, I got, I got to go to bed. So, yeah, so I, I decided I would just play Guilty Gear X's because it's nice and doesn't waste time with a bunch of real easy battles. We'll see, in fact, if I can, well, A, get to the first boss at level 20 and B, beat the first boss. It's kind of a, it's kind of a bit of a gatekeeper there. I, I kind of wish they'd had a, a level 10 boss kind of ease you in. This is where salmon-colored Kai 
So I, I have not even been paying attention to what buttons I'm hitting with Zato. You got your jump button, your kick button, did oh no. Thought I'd left a mine. Your slash button and your heavy slash button. There's no separate dust button in Guilty Gear X. Dust is a I forget how you dust. I always hated dust, so I tried to forget it existed. Then they made it its own button. Because they switched to a Thomas Wave, which was a five-button, by default, five-button arcade cabinet. Oh, this is Sega Naomi, which was, well, however many buttons you needed. I don't know if the normal Naomi layout was four buttons, but this that's what this one had. That's weird, man. See a good number of people playing Zato in Strive. I'm not really, I'm trying not to watch Strive streams anymore. But it's what everybody's playing, it's the it's the hotness, it's got the net codes that all the hardcore streamers wanted. So, I guess I made it to level 20 already. Don't have much health. That's probably going to be a problem because Testament is a very annoying boss who's got all these little... all these little jerks swimming around the screen just pecking at you the whole time. Usually it's the purple guy on the ground who gets me. This purple guy. There he is, trying to get me from behind. I saw you, purple guy. Ah, oh, you jerk. Oh, there's Scully. Watch it. Oh, that stupid skull. All oh, the purple things just sitting back here. Oh, the skull. God. Well, I screwed that all up. And yeah, I didn't even come close. So that sucked. I shouldn't have worried so much about the skull. Ah. I can't really... Testament, the stupid purple thing. I hate that. Not not a big fan of the first boss. Later bosses are just sort of amped up versions of the regular characters with special colors, which is cool. The trick is getting past uh, basically the first two bosses. The second boss is at level 30, and that's... Spoilers, it's, it's dizzy. The, uh, the normal, real arcade mode boss. I haven't really gone back and played arcade mode. All right, I'm gonna hit my uh, my square button, whatever that may be. I'm running a PS4 stick through a Brook Super Converter to the Dreamcast. Oh, that's the default color. Oh, the music. How did it get even louder than it ever was before? I think I... I there's no volume adjustment in the game, so I couldn't have screwed that up, did I? Cool stuff is happening when I hit the button and move the stick, so I guess I should try out some supers, but I'm so bad with supers. Maybe I just won't worry about them. I seem to be doing pretty good just kind of zoning with, not zoning, grooving, shall we say, with Sato. Just doing stuff. I haven't even been sort of consciously trying to do the chain combo progression, which of course goes punch kick, punch kick slash heavy slash. Stop that. Oh, get him little creature thing. That was more of a chain combo there. Typical chain. Combo, yo! Try 
I have a little super motion in my dice. Alright. Well, I've only got two supers. Uh, I forget what that... On number eight, I forget what that first word means. It might mean in air. Quarter circle forward times two slash. Let's see if it's in air. Oh, I killed him. Oh, God. I wanted to try my friggin' super game. Well, he died too. It was too easy. I feel like I screwed up the volume, so the balance somehow. The music is so loud and the sound effects. Not, I don't know what I did. I don't think I did anything. It's just weird. The music's always super loud in this game, so I think I'm just... I just forgot just how loud it is. I'm still trying to find a decent volume level for the game that won't drown out my commentary all the time. I don't know if I'm there yet. Yeah, that's in the air. Oh, and it, what is it? Just go straight across the screen, not even down? What the heck is that? See, and I get my buns hit, beat up trying to do supers. Let that be a lesson to me. Ah. They give me that health back. I need health back. I wasted it. Oh, no. I used to read it as Zato Eno. Is that right? Did I make that up? Or I think I must have made that up. Oh, it's so loud. Hey. Wow, I dizzied him. Oh, I missed. Hey, you can't dodge that. Oh, son of a... <gasps> I got turned around. Oh, no! Well, I'm blowing it. Way to go. Way to go. Please give me a lot of health back. Oh, dang it. Oh, it's the two guys I really... Duh. I can't say I hate them the most, but they're annoying to fight. They're just so freeform weirdos. They both are on this flickery red stage, which is... not super gentle on my eyeballs. Oh! Oh, just take the cue ball in the face! Still not, not enough health, really. I'm just going to get nibbled to death. Yeah, not, not a good, not a good way to go in. Oh, plus I just got wailed on. Ah. What? Maybe you can steer that super or something, because that's just not right. I'm dead. What is going on? Yeah, I gotta try his other super. Maybe if I hold down it would go down? That's such a weird... All right, I know I stink. Gosh. Oh shoot, I kind of wanted to see the... I can't get out of this, can I? Nope, and in fact, well, that's one way to get out of it. Pick the wrong character, now I'll have to bail.
was trying to see if I could hit select and start together to uh, back out. Now there's some cool character colors. Oh my goodness. Okay, so did I... Hmm. There's no... nothing there. Now sound test has... This level max thing in the upper right, uh, which button do I suppose is the Y button? That's not it. That's B. Uh, there we go. Silent, small, medium, standard. Maybe I should have had it on standard. Oh, wait, let me try small. Such weird terms. I don't think that's going to change the game music, though. Wait a sec. Did I leave? Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, I can't use menus anymore. I should not be allowed. Gosh dang it. I should do arcade mode at some point. Oh, that's interesting. Russia. I guess I would learn a lot about the game if I actually played through arcade mode. And there's probably endings for the characters and all that good stuff. Hey, look at this wacky color. So this is Russia. Okay. All right. Try not to launch the wrong thing. See that? Okay, so I want to do uh, ooh, small. That should be a definite difference, right? If it actually affects the music level during the game. Oh, I think it did. Well, I'm a moron. I had the music on the wrong setting. Yeah, I sure did. Okay, I'm going to raise my actual volume setting on the recording. Okay, and, uh, let's see here. Oh, I am actually in survival, so I, I forgot. I thought I, anyway. Um, so I'm going to try setting the music to standard or whatever standard was looking like. So there actually is a music volume control. It's in sound test. That's and it affects the game. That's so uh, kind of bizarre. Uh, so small, medium, standard. Hmm. Maybe I should have it on medium. Well, let's see what standard sounds like. I guess. Sure. Okay. Thank 
That sounds okay, I think. Circle button. I think it was that white color. Volume level looks okay. So Max was just super cranked, music-wise. I never even realized you could affect the music volume. Ah, that's about how smart I am. That's a good little chant. I love this color. Oh! Of course, in uh, Strive, I've noticed that it's got like Tron glowy color stuff for characters. We didn't have that back in this day. We just had good, good color sets. Just cool looks, man. Oh no, I got. Oh. Wow, I thought I got crushed. I, I am definitely not doing great on the health front. Oh yeah, and I gotta try out my super. Oh, there's so much to do. Oh, ooh. No, it did get a little loud somehow. How did that happen? Oh no, this one's still super loud. Alright, jeez. Well, thanks for coming and joining my audio test. What if... We just do medium. See, that's so much quieter. I guess we have to get back to like that stage in particular, the uh, autumnal one. That's got a really loud track. So Axel is probably the character I hate fighting the most. Stupid weapon he's got in this ridiculous range. I love the red look of his pseudopods. Ooh. I tried holding down and it didn't go down, so I don't care. But it's facing down initially. Do you have to... Maybe you have to trigger? But there's no instructions in the Move list about stealing it. So, I don't know. Maybe it's just not possible. Why would a, why would an in air super just go straight across the screen? That is Maybe you're supposed to trigger it close to the ground. It just seems really weird. <laughs> Mm. Or it's just supposed to be an anti-air super, but that seems weird too. Ah, oh, jeez. Oh, man, I'm getting torn up. Okay, right. Well, that, uh, he just air uh, I don't like that super, I've decided. Supers are dumb. That's my other super. Back forward, heavy smash. Really? Well, that was, that was perfect timing. Good job. Oh, wow. 
this music got that music got loud. Jeez. I don't know what to do about this music. I guess that's just about the setting I want. Mm. I don't know, we'll see. We'll see. Bye. Oh, God. That's such a cool throw animation. At least I assume it's a throw. Oh, sweet. Oh, no. Ooh, shark. Well, I'm not even going to make it to the boss, though. So that half circle back forward, that's that's more my, my speed as far as super goes, I guess. Supers, supers go. It's still getting really... Mm. Hang on. Adjusted the volume down a notch. I'll probably still be inaudible. Ooh. That was not a proper. Oh. Huh. I'm not sure that juggle with the super actually did a whole lot of damage. Well, actually, I think he was dead. I'm not sure it would do much damage. I have a little more health this time. Oh, gosh. Okay, well, there goes the health. Here comes the purple guy. There's Bonesy. Oh my gosh, he's just clubbing me. Wow. I don't like this guy. He, uh, he usually doesn't just whack me like that, though. All right. Gonna hit triangle. Shiori Fukai Zato Sara. Nutsama, Nani Monoda, Bakeno Kawa, hi there. This purple color is kind of cool. Oh, that, oh, but it, it's making my eyes go funny with this crazy flashing crimson background demon thing. Super and blowing it and losing health. Oh, it didn't even KO him. I got almost all my health back though. I don't usually like to mess with the volume balance in games when I'm for recording, but the music in this game on standard is still ridiculously loud. Oh, 
Oh, that was awesome. So I'm actually kind of enjoying Zato. Ooh. Since he is pretty easy to play intuitively, as it were. Look at me, now I'm a demon thing. Just move my plasm into a demon shape on my body. I don't know what the story with Zato is. I should do story mode, or arcade mode, and find out. And... That off chuckles. Siori that was awesome. Not intentional at all, but it worked out. Oh no, that hurts a lot. <sighs> oh, my health, my life. You jerk, I was looking good. Now I'm dead. Wow. Well, uh... Uh, I lost. Oh my gosh. Wow. Just when it was looking good, getting to the boss with a big chunk of health bar, and then, uh, no, three hits. Three hits from that guy. Tagger, is that it? Uh, oh, wait, that's not his name. Tempkin. Um. All right, that was triangle square. Okay, revenge on Potemkin. Uh, man, I was doing so good. Mm, frosty color. Oh. Oh, sheep. Sheep. No oh, my gosh. Oh, I'm going to just die in the first round. Oh. Wow, I sure am. Oh my gosh. Wow, so that that guy is a problem for me with Sato, I guess. Holy smokes. Oh my gosh. What am I going to do about that? I mean, I'm just going to die every time I get to him. He should have killed me. If it had been any other stage, I would have been just straight dead. Oh my god. I mean, I'm, I'm so dead. I, uh, shut up. That's, that's mean. You didn't beat me. Potemkin beat me. Oh. I mean, I might actually have to, like, learn stuff to beat Potemkin. I don't want to learn stuff. Oh, 
The whole reason I like this Guilty Gear in particular is that you just kind of jump in and do stuff. At least I do, and it feels good. But it's probably getting me killed. Oof. Oh my god, what oh, stupid ninjas. Your stupid mesh shirts that you think are so sexy. Ow. I'm just gonna be worried about Potemkin. Oh well, here we go. So that's good. Get it over with fast. I haven't, I haven't noticed this complete. He's got a belt under his crotch. That's nice. I, I haven't had this problem against Potemkin with other characters so far. He's just getting lucky. I don't know. So there's some good range. I pushed him way back. Can't grab me there. Uh oh. Yee. He's still coming. Just die. Okay, that, that was better. Shiori <laughs> Fukaya. Oh. oh, dang it. Oh, dang it. I did a super, but she was already gone, and I hit a big old throw. Give me health back, please. Uh, okay, don't choke. Two levels to go. Just, just, just get him. Shiori Fukaya. Oh man. She just blasted me right off the bat. Oh, I've already lost a ton of health. Gosh darn it. Jeez. Just big slash in my face right at the start of the match. Arg. Oh, but I'm looking good on health, so don't... Okay, I should... This is it. This is it. This is my chance. Don't screw it up. Don't just let him just waste you. It's time to... Uh. Oh, he blocked all that. Yeah. So that was interesting. I guess I never really realized that if you can pressure him enough, he doesn't get to call his little buddies out. 
Uh, I don't know why that never occurred to me before. I guess it's because I've rarely been able to apply pressure like that. Oh, I'm that. Wow, I'm back to full health. That's right, I forgot you get a big health bonus after beating that boss. Oh. oh no. Kai is tough and he's the easiest character to kick ass with. Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh no. Better run, Salmon Boy. Oh. Oh. Gosh darn it. I was at full health. I just blitzed me. And I took it in the face. Gosh. Well, I guess we're in Russia now. That's right, I forgot they have this little intro they do. Ooh. Oh. Wow, I can't air dash. There's an air dash. Didn't help me. Whoa. Uh, <sighs> yikes. Oh no. Oh no. She's moving too fast. to the second boss with no health. But, uh, anyway, that, that's good. I made it. Oh, well, we both have weird colored devil forms, Dizzy. We're like, we're like devil buddies. Oh, no. Oh, I got a good chunk of health back. Ah, oh, but it's good. No. Oh. I haven't fought her in so long, I don't really remember anything about it. Ah. Jeez. She's just got all this stuff, too, that hits you from wherever. Well, that went poorly. Uh, Alright, I gotta call it there. I got a super late start. I have not been getting to bed on time for like three, four nights in a row. It's getting ridiculous. I thought I would tonight. I I ended up meeting somebody, hanging out with someone for the first time since the pandemic started. That lunch turned into two hours. It just flew by somehow, so uh, I have once again mismanaged my time. And uh, so I have to go. Thanks for watching this. Uh, thanks for sitting through the volume adjustments. Um, hopefully, hopefully this came out in the end at some sort of listenable volume level. I don't know. I don't know if you, you probably just haven't been able to hear me all along. It's just drowning out this sound. I, I, who knows? Well, hopefully it's good. Everything's great. I'll just pretend it is. Uh, uh, I should really have some kind of monitoring function so I can actually tell what the output sounds like, but I'm not that sophisticated. So, uh, let's see. This was, uh, what the heck? Uh, this is Monday night. Um, tomorrow I'm going to play Virtue Fighter 5 Ultimate Showdown. Uh, 
that's Tuesday, Wednesday, I'm going to play Virtua Fighter 4 Evolution, uh, Jackie Bryan in quest mode. Thursday, uh, probably more Virtua Fighter 5 Ultimate Showdown, and I'm just like picking a character, making a costume, and then running them through arcade mode on the very hard difficulty, which actually isn't that difficult. Uh, Friday, King of Fighters 2000, Saturday, Tekken 5 Dark Resurrection, and Sunday, more Virtua Fighter 4 Evolution, Jackie Bryant. Quest mode, a uh, very hard tournament I'm bashing my head against, but uh, it's sort of fun anyway. All right, so that's uh, that's what's coming up on this channel. Thanks for again for enduring, and uh, uh, I, I know I don't do a great job of showcasing it, but this Guilty Gear, Guilty Gear X on Dreamcast is super cool. Um, it's the only one, it's the only 2D one that actually sort of displayed at the correct screen resolution. After, uh, once they took the series to PlayStation consoles, they just started changing the, the screen resolution somehow, so this, there's all kinds of jaggies and stuff. It's weird. Uh, this one doesn't have that. It's just gorgeous and beautiful 480p on uh, Dreamcast VGA output. And that's that's a good chunk of why I like it. I guess I also like it because it's just, uh, it's they didn't they hadn't start adding all the uh, additional systems that that they started throwing into the game. So it's a uh, it's a little simpler, less stuff to worry about, and uh, gorgeous colors. And uh, yeah, I like it. And hopefully, I've finally got my volume straightened out. Uh, all right, well, I may, I may gonna have to do, do another, well, I'll have to listen back to this and see how the volume went. Hopefully it's all good. All right, I am leaving to go sleepy time. Good night. And, uh, no, that's how I end. I just say good night. Yeah, good night. <laughs>